Electric current is the rate of charge flow. It's not the speed of charge flow, it's the amount of charge per unit time. It doesn't necessarily say how fast the charges are moving, it just says how many charges are passing a fixed point in a certain amount of time. So the rate of charge flow, if a hundred charges pass a fixed point in two seconds, the rate of charge flow is 50 charges per second pass a fixed point. 500 charges in 25 seconds, the rate of charge flow is 20 charges per second. So we don't know how fast these charges are moving, but what we do know is that in the top case, there are more charges passing a fixed point per second than in the bottom case. One equation for electrical current is I is equal to the amount of charge divided by the time. And for some reason, electric current is symbolized by the letter I. Vizzini would say that that is inconceivable. So current is charge per time. Charge is in coulombs. Time is in seconds. Let's try an example. 5.8 coulombs of charge flow through a bulb filament in 3.1 seconds. Find the current. We know the charge. We know the amount of time. This should be a fairly easy problem. 5.8 coulombs divided by 3.1 seconds rounded to two significant figures. That's 1.9 amps or amperes. And one ampere is one coulomb per second. How many electrons flow through the bulb in one hour? We know that electric current is essentially the flow of electrons. Would we be able to figure out how many electrons flow through the bulb in one hour? We don't know the amount of charge that flows through the bulb in one hour, but we can find it because we know that 5.8 coulombs of charge flow every 3.1 seconds. An hour is 3600 seconds. So if we cross multiply and solve that for x, we get 6,735.5 coulombs of charge flow through the bulb every hour. And since an electron has a known quantity of charge associated with it, namely 1.60 times 10 to the negative 19th coulombs, we can figure out how many electrons flow through that bulb filament in one hour. If 1.0 moles of electrons flow through an appliance in 5.6 hours, find the current pulled by the appliance. You might remember from chemistry that a mole is 6.02 times 10 to the 23rd electrons. So what we're going to do here first is find the amount of charge that's carried by that number of electrons. Note that the electron units cancel. And there we have 96,000 320 coulombs of charge. And we are told that that amount of charge flows in 5.6 hours. So in the numerator I'll have my 96,320 and in the denominator we want the time but we want it in seconds. 4.8 amps. Current is the amount of charge flow per unit time specifically the number of coulombs of charge that pass a fixed point in a given number of seconds, i.e. I is equal to amount of charge divided by time. We measure current in amperes, symbolized by capital A. A typical household circuit breaker trips at, say, 20 amps. So huge numbers for current calculations are usually way off base. 